Yes guys, how is it going and welcome back to the adventure and today is a massive one. City versus Borussia Dortmund. Manchester City are off to Germany to take on Borussia Dortmund in a pivotal game in the Champions League. Erling Haaland is officially going back to Dortmund, a place where he scored 86 goals in 88 games and the goals have kept coming since he's changed yellow for blue. City with a win or draw tonight are guaranteed to go through to the round of 16 of the Champions League. However, a win for Dortmund will level it on points, but they still need to win by five or more goals to go top. The Signal Iduna Park has been on my football bucket list for as long as I can remember. It is a dream of mine to go tonight and I cannot wait I'm so excited I get to see the yellow wall in person for the very first time it promises to be one hell of a game with hopefully an atmosphere to match if City win they're through to the round of 16 if Dortmund win it will all go to the final day so it's time to swap this place for Germany and the Signal Iduna Park don't think it gets any more iconic than that and let's get to Dortmund for a massive Champions League game let's go I'm so excited So good morning, I have got my bacon roll. I slept really well, I went to the quiet zone and I'll tell you what, it was well indeed quiet. I kicked across four chairs and I feel magical and refreshed, ready to go to Germany. So let's get on the flight, come on city. At the home of the rivals, it's now time to get to Dortmund, to the Signal Iduna. Come on, City, let's beat them. Well, after all this I've got a pint in the Signal Iduna park watching the team play. Oh, unbelievable. So happy to be here and so excited but nervous. The yellow ball looks insane. Come on, City. That is ridiculous. We need one of those. Some chances out. Well, the noise is because 
Manchester City have a free kick on the edge of the box and they're trying to put them off. It, it put me off. And it's done the job. It's done the game. Oh, that should have been the goal. Mm. For Coco. Oh, that's got to go in. Every time Dorman is getting on that right hand side of the MA, he's been brilliant. He pulled that one into the front. Cancelo can't deal with them both on the road. The Stills going in the middle. I don't even know what formation we're playing. We've got Alvarez and Mara's on the right. It's not starting well. It feels like we're playing Liverpool and Bill the way that we're built on. Not interested in going forward, interested in just keeping the ball. Not a good start for us, but brilliant for Dorman. They're really playing well, they've got the worry. They want us to be honest, we're keeping the ball, doing nothing, and then running it back, looking brilliant on the right and creating some good chances. So we need to sort it out, really. They play very well. The Lord's having three kicks. Oh, oh, oh. The best chance of the game. Right, half time in the second half, we do now. We're going to sum it up really, really quick on the second half, just about to kick off. And uh, yeah, we've been terrible. We've had no really intent on attacking. Cancelo's been pulled apart on the right hand side. Dortmund have been collectively superb. And Drew Bellingham's dictated the play, and they look menacing on the counter attack. Their plan is working. We just don't have that intent. And I'm hearing Haaland's coming off as well. So, like, I, I knew this was happening. Like, I'm desperate to see my team win here. And uh, Pep's just like, oh, a draw will do. I know, I know a draw will do. But, like, it's a lot of people's bucket list to see, uh, see their team win here. But, yeah, disappointing. Come on, better. Oh, better, better. Attacking movement. Come on, Sam. Yes. Oh. Hit it. Ben. Yeah. We got Ben. Yes, Sam. Come on. Like it's going to be taken by Mahrez. I mean, he scored here before in the 2-1 win during lockdown, so you never know, I'm hopeful. <laughs> Arjuna, nil nil, Mara's missed a penalty. The yellow wall was the man of the match by some distance. Like, it was so good. That's what I came to see. Not the football on the pitch. It's just so frustrating. Like, it's another ground that I'm going to have to come back. Well, I'm not complaining that I have to come back to it, but it really would have been nice to win today. And it was there for us. Dorman didn't really have a, an intent on attacking. And Mara's missing another penalty. I'm surprised Pep took Harlan off at half time. But it's not all doing and good. We're through to the next round of the Champions League. We didn't lose. 
it's just uh, we didn't win and yellow wall man of the match This is something right now that I never thought I'd experience in my whole life. I'm here in the yellow wall. I can't believe it. I know it's empty, but this is just unbelievable. Like the atmosphere is where I'm stood right now, but yeah, incredible. I never thought I'd get around here. Just look at this. This is just absolutely unbelievable. This is full to the rafters with people bouncing and cheering. Insane. You know what? I'm going to end it here in the yellow wall. I cannot believe I've done this, but if you guys have enjoyed the video, it's been, it's been, a, been an awful night on the pitch. However, in the yellow wall, just can't make that up. If you have enjoyed the video, make sure to smash the like, subscribe down below. I am coming to a game and I'm going to stand in this yellow wall once in my life. Trust me on that one. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out from Signal Iduna Park.